All right, let's take a look at your forecast. It's looking fantastic for our weekend. We should be looking at partly cloudy skies. There is a small passing shower chance both today and on Saturday, but besides that, looking pretty good. Let's talk about what's going on now. It's already 79 degrees, partly cloudy outside. Our winds are out of the east at 8 miles an hour and a barometer 30, 16 hundredths of an inch. That's fairly high. Expect that to really start to go down as we're heading into next week with that area of low pressure that is Florence heading our way. Dew point also is at 68 degrees. Normally anything over 65 with the dew point, we're saying it is humid. So we do have some humidity that we're dealing with and we'll be dealing with it all weekend long. Here's a look at temperatures, not just in Pittsburgh, but some other communities. Denora 83, Little Trove 79 degrees, 77 lucky sevens in Butler, Catanning and Indiana at this point. Beaver Falls 79 along with Washington and Wheeling coming in at 79 degrees. We do have a couple of areas, Newcastle 81 and Waynesburg at 82 that are already into the 80s as we're heading into the afternoon. I think we hit about 84 for a high today. We did hit 83 yesterday. That's what we forecast. The winds out of the east southeast of 5 to 10 miles an hour. We'll go partly cloudy skies and that's what we're seeing right now. Should hold that steady over the course of the weekend. Here's how I think the rest of the day is going to break down. 84 at 4, 83 and 6 o'clock. Your 8 o'clock temperature coming in at 79. We do dip down just below 70 degrees as we're waking up tomorrow. We get to do it all over again tomorrow. Should be into the mid to low 80s. It does look like tomorrow, Saturday, we'll likely see temperatures just slightly cooler than what we are today by just a degree or two and then a little bit warmer as we're heading into Sunday. Here's a look at model data, and it does show a couple of very isolated showers, at least being possible. We'll watch closely for that. Did see a few of those yesterday, and we'll likely see one or two showers popping up because of the heating of the day once again today. We'll watch closely for that. Nothing severe is expected and probably not even going to see a thunderstorm that's going to be possible. Now, over the next couple of days, you can probably tell when Florence is going to be arriving, or at least the remnants of Florence, if you said Monday, yeah, you're right. That's the day where we're going to be looking at some strong chances for some rain because of Hurricane. What is now Hurricane Florence will be uh, it's quickly weakening, so it will be a tropical storm over the afternoon. Uh, this is the latest track, though. This is Tuesday at 1 o'clock. Here is where they put the center, uh, at least the remnants of Florence, as it really quickly moves off to the northeast. But this storm is going to be at least impacting us or having a chance to impact us with some rain. It does look like at this point it's pretty much a sure thing. Now, record amounts of rain and flooding going to happen into the Carolinas. For us, we're looking at generally about one to two inches of rain, at least what this model is showing. But I will tell you that other model data is showing between two and three. So we're going to hold steady with about two to three inches is what you should expect widespread when it comes to rain. And we're going to watch closely for that. There's your seven day outlook. 84 today for high 83 your Saturday high. We'll bump it up to 86 degrees on Sunday. Because of Florence moving through and all the rain we're expecting, high temperatures on Monday likely won't hit the 80 degree mark. We'll go 78 there. We will be waterlogged. Big concern at this point, not just with river flooding like what we saw over last weekend, but also we might, especially if we see that two to three inch range, could see some flash flooding in mm -hmm. some of the cities. So we'll watch closely there as well. All right, but a nice summery weekend before yes, then. Yes, exactly. All right, Enjoy thank it. you, Ron.